Good morning. Uh, we are in the early stages of a devotional series on the book of Luke. And if you didn't catch yesterday's, which was the first one, I encourage you to go back and take a look at it. Today, we're in Luke chapter 1, verses 5 through 7. Not real exciting verses, but hear me out. In the time of Herod, king of Judea, there was a priest named Zechariah who belonged to the priestly division of Abijah. His wife Elizabeth was also a descendant of Aaron. Both of them were upright in the sight of God, observing all the, co the Lord's commandments and regulations blamelessly, but they had no children, because Elizabeth was barren, and they were both well along in years. And the title for today's devotion is, Our Faith Has Historic Roots. And there's two things that I want to I wanna stress in this devotion. And I stress this first point quite often in my devotions. Christianity is not some leap of faith. It's not leaping out into a dark world and not knowing what you're grabbing onto or who's going to grab onto you. Christianity is steeply rooted in history. He's recording names and descendants and, and time periods and who's in charge of the area, Herod, king of Judea. My point is, the Christian faith is not some mystical thing that we're trying to transcend our minds into seeing something. I mean, God came down to earth with his word, prophets, teachers, leaders, finally Jesus, who is the word become flesh, and he enters history. I think that's incredible. Secondly, notice who God uses. Ordinary people like you and me. I mean, Zechariah is no big deal. Yes, he's of the Levitical line of Aaron. He's one of the priests, but he's not the high priest. He's just doing his little duties. And he's living life, and he's living life with his wife, Elizabeth. And even though they're upright, and even though they're God-fearing and believing... Not everything goes the way they want it to go. They're, they don't have a child. I can imagine that they've lived with fear and doubt. I imagine that they've been angry and fearful. I, I imagine there have been tears shed, wondering where God is and what God's doing and why. They're a lot like us. They're just living their lives. They just keep on going. They're, they've got to trust that God's got a plan. They've got to trust that they're in it, even if they don't understand it. Now, once something wonderful happens to them, and God blesses them with a child, but that doesn't always happen. Sometimes at the end of the day, someone may die. Someone may not get the healing. But the question is, do they see God's presence, and do they feel his presence in the moment? Do they understand that he is in control, even if it feels like he's not? Boy, that's a lesson for me today, and I hope it's a lesson for you today, that God calls ordinary people in human history to get done what he wants to get done. Well, I pray that this devotion is a blessing to you. I encourage you to read the devotion that's attached. Have a firmly rooted day.